My first love of seaweeds when I went diving off the coast and I was asked if I would go and have a look at seaweeds and would I do some survey work. I went diving and I got to see what the seaweeds were like under the water and then I was truly sort of taken over by them. I was really hooked on them because underwater there was this whole new world. That's better. Yeah, that's better. I hope a new display planned for the museum will reveal the beauty of this mysterious submarine habitat. What we're going to do is we're going to make a bit like stained glass windows, these panels made of glass. And inside that we're going to put seaweeds. When it's all put together, it'll hopefully recreate a feel of what it's like to be in a kelp forest. When the sea is out, you tend to see seaweeds just draped one over the other and they often look rather dull and rather brown. But once they're under the water, it's like a whole wonderful kaleidoscope of colours and shapes. Isn't it? Seaweeds are incredibly important organisms on the planet. They have a fossil history which dates back to about 1.2 billion years. They've survived things like the loss of the dinosaurs. There are real challenges getting these specimens repaired. It's important to get them as dry as we can as quickly as possible. Really nice. Don't you think these will press well? Yeah, and they're quite nice the way they kind of ruffle up. In the display, we want to show some of the green seaweeds and particularly some of the very beautiful reds that occur as well. We also want to put in the large kelps to give them a sense of wonder of the scale of the forests that they find. And for that, we need to collect some of the really big kelps found subtidally. are going to dive on Junko's Reef, so they're going to go down to about 15 metres. The kelp forests are incredibly important because the kelp plants themselves, which might be one or two metres or more high, create this amazing architecture, which is the framework for all the other organisms that live within the kelp forest provides them with their habitat, with their food, with their shelter, nurseries for little fish. Although seaweeds are great survivors, there are worrying signs that climate change is beginning to affect them. As the waters get warmer, they tend to disappear. That changes the whole nature of the shore. Divers up, 12.53. These fantastic red seaweeds, they're going to look absolutely beautiful, I think, once they're pressed tonight. I'm hoping that our recreation will completely change people's perception of seaweeds and that they start to appreciate the beauty and the value of the kelp forests. <laughs>